guys, uh, if you want to take a peek over here, um, we're kind of underway with the project getting started. FPL was just here a minute ago. Another job, another snake, I guess. Uh, it's a Scarlet King snake. We'll keep him here in this cooler. Thanks for stopping by again. Um, got a cool little project for you. This one is interesting because it's two services on either side of a, two houses next to each other and the services are directly across. So it's, you know, got a cool aesthetic to it where you're gonna be able to see both projects. I'm gonna try and do like a cool time lapse so you can see both being done at once. Um, these are for solar, solar upgrade to the home. So we need to make sure that the service disconnect is outside and it's heavy duty enough to handle the power that's being fed back into the grid as, as well as the power that the house is using so it needs to be a little heavier duty system um, we're in the Palm Beach area so um, it's a nice little project uh, if you want to follow along and any questions or concerns or anything like that go ahead and uh, drop down and let me know um, again if there's anything you see that you think we could improve upon or anything that you're curious about you know it's always nice to go ahead and answer those questions for you so uh, stay tuned you'll be seeing in just one second and, and we'll we'll get you a front row seat at this project hey guys uh, if you want to take a peek over here um, we're kind of underway with the project getting started FPL was just here a minute ago and uh, Follow along and check out uh, the dual services we got today for you. So you get to sue one now. Ladies and gentlemen, as you can see, we got back-to-back -back services on uh, two houses. Um, pretty interesting project.
Could you could you buy this one? Another job, another snake, I guess. Uh, it's a scarlet king snake. Zach caught it earlier. He just grabbed it, right, Zach? Yeah. How'd it go? We're, we're fine. Well, well, what happened, though? Um, well, took the hammer, went to dig the dirt out for the pipe. The snake jumped out, and I grabbed it. Nice. This is him right here. It's a scarlet king snake. I was already handling him, so he's like used to me holding him. And they're generally not aggressive at all. We'll let him go once once we're done working here. And we're not gonna disturb him anymore. But he's a nice little guy. Yeah, yeah, we'll let we'll let him go on the inspector. <laughs> we could if we trained him, you know, we could take like a piece of number eight like this here, and we could hook it on his tail. And he could he could uh, pull wire for us if we, <laughs> you know what I mean. <laughs> I don't think he'd, yeah, I don't think he'd mind much. We'd give him some good snacks. Anyway, cool little guy. We'll let him go when we finish, so that you know we don't want him to get hurt while we're in the process of working. We'll keep him here in this cooler. Push it. it yeah. All right, push it. So we're gonna have to put a new ground bar somewhere in there and take all the grounds off. All right, so they got room. I mean, that's a ground point up there. So if we bring it over up there, we can put a ground bar up there. Mm-hmm. And bring but it all up. you need a square D ground bar. Well, you could steal one of these ones. Just unscrew it and move it up one there. One of these? Yeah, yeah. Take it up there. That one doesn't really have much in it, right? No, this one is some one, two, three grounds. I mean, Perfect. It. And it'll bolt right up there. how many neutrals it has, because the neutrals are what we got to move back. Yeah, but if we take in the ground, we got room for the neutrals. Mm -hmm. We got plenty of room. Yeah, this one is just one screw, mm -hmm. literally, and then you just pop it out of here. And it will go right on them two dimples. With the same screw we take out of here, we put it on that lug. Yeah.
guys, you haven't seen my boss boss man. So it's important too to just leave a loop in here, service loop for future reference. Danny's Bosch screw chip. These are really cool screw tips because they can do flat head, or I'm sorry, Phillips head, square tip, and then the one weird square tip slash flat head. They're, they're real nice. They grab too, on a number two screw, they grab real nice, like they don't strip easy at all. So they're my favorite. I do like Guardian you know, other. I like them a lot. They helped me out one time. But we had a customer that had a solar system that was messing up and they went out there and took care of it for them. I mean they weren't even actually our customer. They were just calling us. Just doing Danny. So, since this is not the first means of disconnect anymore, we got to separate the grounds and neutrals. So, we took one of the bars that we're running here, added it as a ground bar up top. So we have to splice all the ones coming from the bottom to extend them up to the top, and all the ones from the top, we just have to land them on the ground bar. All right, thanks, Dan. Well. Yeah. So if I didn't have, if I didn't have that behind the building. This customer would have been out of power for weeks. You know what I mean? Because it's in weeks. We spent a whole day trying to put one of those together. And uh, oh yeah, 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 yeah. But it's nice when you can just get a temporary situation, so the customer still got power. You know? Just cut it off smooth on the end, and it'll go right through. No, it's not that. It's got trapped between the. Uh, Okay. On the, on the wrong side of these. Yeah, he said something about leaving the loop. <laughs> I just wrapping it up today um, you know double uh, double whammy as you can say uh, two, two meter cans removed and replaced service panel upgrade you can see here solar panels on the roof so yeah uh, job came out nice we had a another uh, serpent visitor again a, a scarlet king snake as I'm sure you saw a cute little guy uh, he had to make make his uh, visit and we we enjoyed that and it was a little reprieve from the job but it's a really warm day out today beautiful South Florida sunshine um, so can't get much better than that uh, stay tuned for the next you know a ep couple episodes from now we're gonna have something really cool but we have some really nice stuff coming out in the weeks coming ahead so anyway take care hope you guys are having a great day until the next time